Welcome to our Senior Options 2021. This is a quick video on how to use this Google site. So as you can see, there is an introduction and then there is this video. Underneath this video is an options video, S4 going into S5. It is quite important that you watch this video. Underneath the options video are three buttons. Okay, that tell you about our foundation apprenticeships, open university and future learning courses and our career support. If I click on the foundation apprenticeship, it will then take you to a different page that gives you more information on these, including a booklet. If I click on the open university button, it will then take you to another page that tells you more about our open university options that we have for you and we have our future learn options. This page here is for our S6 pupils only and it is in addition to the four subject choices that you pick. We then also have a page for our career support um, and this is a page where you can make an appointment, you can find an apprenticeship or you can also follow um, everything that we do on Twitter and it gives you more information about the support that we have in place for careers. If I then scroll down, if you are thinking about leaving, you click this button to fill in the potential leavers form. Can I also remind you that if you are going into S5, you need to choose five subjects, one in each column and one of these subjects must be English. If you are in A6 or going into A6, you must choose four subjects leaving one of the columns blank. This is your options form. You can see that there are five columns and every column has advanced higher or higher or other options at the bottom here. It goes across the two pages. If you are interested in learning more about a particular subject, if you click on the subject, it will then direct you to a new page that will give you more information about that subject. So that is the options form. And then if you scroll down, there is a learner's pathway booklet that tells you about all the progressions. If I then scroll down, it, this is your first options form that you should complete. You need to put your name, your surname, your class, your super pupil support manager, and then click next. And there will be all the different options for you to choose. You need to then choose your subjects. Please remember if you're in S, going into S5, you're choosing five subjects. If you're going into A6, you are choosing four subjects. There is also a space for um, have you talked this over with your parents or guardians. You either need to tick yes or no here and follow the instructions. 